to today's video. I hate it when my cupboards are open. Welcome to today. Today is a Monday. It is Math Monday. Math Monday because- Oh, that was so fun. Someone else taught me. So if he's doing math today and we had a friend help her out and it taught her so good and she was so excited to actually like understand it and she loved it. But anyway, good morning. We also have our first writing lesson since, well actually our group lesson since um, Christmas. So good morning, welcome to today and Sophie's got a trick. Hopefully it works. She normally caught it. Oh, so you close. Catch it again. Give me it. Okay. So watch, this is her trick. Oh. You so, are doing bad when we try and show it off. Yeah, when we show it off, she does badly. Oh, there she did it! Try it again, good job. <laughs> Our puppies, like we got two puppies at the same time. You guys don't forget that. We had two puppies at the same time. Yay! Good girl! All right. And let's see if Molly can do it. And our puppies get jealous of one another. Hey, JJ, where are you going? Ruby's just having breakfast. She's having lunch. Alright, let's see. Can Daisy do it? Mo Oops. <laughs> she plays catch. Oh, she can do it too. Maybe this is something all dogs can do. But you know, we have a deaf dog, so it makes it extra special. Oops. She does do it really good. Yay! <laughs> And what's weird about Daisy is that Daisy's very uh, territorial about her stuff. Like, she doesn't want to fight anybody for it. So she'll take her stuff and store it in her den, in her in her crate. And she keeps everything there because she doesn't like anybody to touch her stuff. Yeah, kind of like Sophie. Work. What happened? I hurt myself. How? Um, I walked into the table. Oh. <laughs> um, but now I won't get hurt again. Or maybe it'll be one of those days where I get hurt every year. Five minutes, I hope not, because it's a riding day. We're on our way to riding. Uh, it, it's all different now, so we're going to do a bunch of running around before we go riding and then show up at riding. But I wanted to explain to you guys, I don't know what it's like where you guys are, but in, in where we live, they're like trying to keep everyone as safe as possible. Everybody's getting COVID. Like, I don't think anybody's going to get away from it this time because we're not locked down. So everybody has it. Like, ever last year, I didn't know a single person that had COVID this year. I know someone who died from it. I know like half of my family, extended family, like far from us, have it. Like it's just widespread this year. So it's nerve wracking to go out there because when you have horses and you're locked down for a week and you can't go there, like I just worry not being able to check on them and make sure that they're okay and making sure that they have like, how will we even get them food? when if we got locked down like it's just scary when you have horses that you need to take care of and and not just for us with horses and so many people and different reasons that it's scary to, to have to be locked down for a week in the past if you got a cold you were able to just go out and keep on living life but now with the covid you have to stay home so anyways uh, our barn is doing it all differently everybody has riding time so we all have scheduled times our classes are going to be way smaller uh less people in the barn and just so many more protocols that we have to do in the barn like it's just going to be insane amounts of work and insane amounts of of and insane amounts of differences so anyway i just wanted to tell you guys that that even though we're going to lesson still we're doing a lot of things to make sure that we um are all being safe there are lots of new rules for the barn in itself like i even carry to a roll of toilet paper <laughs> in my purse because sophie and i pee a lot at the barn and they don't even have toilet paper there right now because they don't want like people touching the same stuff and and so we bring our own toilet paper and be extra careful you guys <laughs> so we are in pv mart that's what tractor supply store is called now in want? Canada. It's called PV Mart. Can we go where I want? Um, I really want these. Yeah, we can go where you want. But look. Oh, wait. I want these. I don't want these ones. I want the winter ones. Like the really warm ones. Like these ones? No. Of course, they're out now because it's going to be spring soon, you guys. These. They're like a ginormous snowsuit, kind of, but they're just really warm. You look like a marshmallow, but actually, it's so cute. I love it. On. Yeah, she has a big sweater on. Do you think it's too big? No. You like it? I can 
wear a sweater with it and be comfortable. I like it. And show them the inside. It's got fur on the inside. They have every color, yeah, navy. I like it. They have super fun spiky balls here. <laughs> and squishy balls. Do you prefer spikes? Or squishy balls? These the things that I need. Sophie's still into. But it's seven, only $37. Sophie's still really into her bracelets. I want this. See, look. You stick it. Yeah, they don't work. They never work. All right, that one works. It's baby Jack's birthday. He's turning three. He's not a baby anymore. I'm trying to decide what I should buy him for his birthday. It's his birthday next weekend. I like this store because they have Schleich. Oh, that one's a cute one. There's more different ones. Yeah, there's all different ones. All different ones. So today we got a long lost Christmas card from a viewer with a orange kitty like we have and a border collie like we have we did not build a snowman yet because we still don't have any snow and inside it says enjoying you bond with penny i had a grumpy mare too so i thank you to the lady that sent this to me because it means so much to have somebody else understand the struggle you have when you have a, a grumpy mare like it just means a lot to know that somebody else understands and has been there and has done the same thing and succeeded and it just means a lot to I know all mares are grumpy all mares all are mares. grumpy no not all mares penny or stella was the she sweetest horse oh my gosh you forget them i watched back videos of stella and she was sweet and she was so sweet to the horses she she was sweet sweet girl she let willow bite her she let willow used to stand underneath her and reach up and bite her neck all the time over and over and over again and as stella would just stand there and let her anyway it's just nice to feel that somebody understands so thank you for your christmas card even though it's a little bit late it's still very much loved and appreciated we're here a little bit early yeah hi <laughs> you got a bag over your hay did ya you know how to get in there <laughs> they don't know how to do it they're like this is crap <laughs> you guys see they got a hay net over their bale which i like got lots of time to eat all that hay <laughs> we're a little early but i had to come and grab our gray ba grain bags before it got too dark we are here at the barn. We're gonna go see who we're riding. I definitely did not drop my brain before. All right, so uh, Sophie and Gabby don't have anybody written down. Well, I'm riding my fat little pony. All right, let's go get your fat little pony. <laughs> now, if you get cold, I want like throw you things. Well, who are you riding? Oh. <laughs> yeah. So we're in this big, we're in this big deep freeze tonight. It's supposed to be minus 30. It's supposed to feel like minus 30 tonight in the morning. We got our group. This is our new group, you guys. Our Monday night group for the foreseeable future. Four kids. Oh. Uh, you want me to help you? All right. Uh, is somebody going to help Sophie? All right. They have got a whole group. They don't need me. So there's a new way to walk Storm back, I guess. Yeah. I'll show you. It's a shortcut past the ice. Oh, like just go straight. Yeah, there. you're smart. I'm pretty. Can you put it on the flight on this lock? Oh, the lock was frozen, you guys. Are I had to like, frozen? yeah, frozen solid. I'm not gonna lie. Masks make me miserable. <laughs> They fog up my glasses. If I didn't have to not see, then it wouldn't bother me that much. But not being able to see is so irritating. Oh, and it's cold. Being cold is irritating too. Oh, I hear Chino screaming. That's Chino. All right, we got one pony. You might guys might not be able to see, but we got him. We rode, uh, Gabby rode him yesterday. And you know what he said? What? Oh, where is Julia? <laughs> Because Gabby makes him do more than he wants. Right, we're taking the shortcut so Stormy Boy doesn't have to go through the ice. Kate went with all of them, so now they all have their ponies, and Kate still doesn't have her pony. That's what she normally does. And Lily's easy to catch, though. All 
All right, I'll stay here and hold the gate. Are you okay? You want to take my light? Okay. You need me to come in? She's really easy. Watch, today will be the day she runs. Since the last time she walked past her, because she was in the shelter, so she checked the shelter first. Being blind is going to be difficult. <laughs> We're here for like four hours. Six till, six till eight, two hours. <laughs> Feels like four hours, you guys. Feels like four hours. Holy heck, it's cold. I'm already frozen. Frozen and blind and my farrier comes tomorrow today when you guys are watching this or maybe tomorrow whatever our farrier comes Yeah, tomorrow when you guys are watching this our farrier comes and Sam said that he's going to Show me how to heat up this big heater things that we can put on there because it's gonna be like I said minus 30 degrees Celsius which is minus like Minus 20 I don't know minus 15 Fahrenheit cold All right I see a light <laughs> I see a light that means that you did it I did. it is cold so do you have mitts honey no. do you have you want mitts no yeah they don't help that's how cold it is mine helps so much oh you got warmer mitts on, it's like a fuzz on the inside but it's not actually fuzzy it's just a tiny oh thing. those are your riding gloves yeah. okay so are leather gloves actually warmer depends See, look, mine's soft on the inside. Feel it. Oh, yeah, I can see it. It's Feel nice. it with your hands. I don't want to take off my mitts. It's my... warm, too. Yeah, they're nice. Feel silly not having a coat on? I'm going to warm up on my ride. Oh. All right, get going. Gabby, who are you riding today? Oh, oh you got Grayfin. Oh, so. Who else was I riding? Yeah. Reggie? I hope not. Grayfin on Mondays and then Chino on Wednesdays and Fridays. So what's really cool though is that we call we call Grayfin Grayfin. No, we we call Brandon Finn Grayfin because he's gray. And on Instagram, somebody said Goldfin, and I love it. So on Instagram, people are calling him Goldfin. I love oh, it because I, I saw Finn he likes gold. Where it's like Grayfin is GF. I'm like. Why would I get a horse and call it girlfriend? <laughs> what is GF? GF stands for girlfriend, but they say it stands for gray fit. Oh. <laughs> and then actually, when you're talking about your girlfriend, yeah, that's my GF. That's girlfriend. All right, so guys, go get your GF. go get your GF ready. <laughs> <laughs> so the kitty is licking Gabby. Look. I could feel like the sandpaper this way, tongue through your gloves. Yeah. He's licking He's her gloves. Getting caught on the gloves. And then before you know it, Gabby's got like a hole in her brand new Christmas gloves. I can fix you his tongue. He just needed to clean his tongue. <laughs> <laughs> My tongue needs to get cleaned. I will clean it on your gloves. We left our trusty, dusty ladder here. I won't be riding in the next couple of days either, so we'll probably leave it here. But as soon as it warms up again, I'm going to ride Penny. So the first one in is Sophie girl right after her mom's heart. I miss the big lesson group. I miss it because I like a lot of kids and a lot of noise. I can't see Sophie's thumb. But I definitely do feel warm. This actually feels hot today. Oh. Did you guys take our horse back? Yeah. yeah. Oh, thanks. I like you doing it a lot better than me. <laughs> Yeah, here. Yeah, go in the car. Say thank you to Brandon. We'll see you Wednesday. All right, put the AirPods away. Took off my mask. I'm driving down. Oh, it's so cold. I won't even be warm tonight, you guys. It's only 7:30. Mm -hmm. That worked out perfectly. So, um, there's storm in front of us. Good boy, sweet boy. Isn't he the cutest boy? I just love him. I just love him. I can't feel my legs feel anything but anyways I told Gabby I'd come with her to put Grayfin out Sam's driving me over Sam will you go with her because you didn't get cold this day and I'm frozen that's one thing I like about the girls being together with other girls is that they do like all everything by themselves they do everything together like Sophie needs help to get Finn in and out because Chino tries to get out the gate when he sees Finn coming and so it's just safer for our horses to have two We're people. Anyway, our friend from Barn Boots and Country Roots, Jen, the mom, everybody in the barn was complaining because the masks make your nose run and they make your whole, they 
all the moisture from your mouth from breathing and from your nose goes into the mask and then like your face is all wet and you're wearing the mask the mask is all wet it's just awful and so she brought us paper towel from the other room it's soaked so we put this dry paper towel inside of our masks instantly my glasses stopped fogging up the paper towel is absolutely soaked like I can't get over it but my mask wasn't wet on my face it was so much more comfortable like so much more comfortable you guys so if you have to wear a mask all day every day day put paper towel in there you have to change it out every couple of hours probably while if it's wet but it's amazing it works so good it works so good don't you know that you're beautiful?